The wind looks to play a factor today, though it isn't keeping the homecoming crowd at bay as the Slippery Rock Rock welcome the California Vulcans to Mahalik Thompson Stadium in a battle for PSAC West supremacy. Good afternoon, everyone. My name is Will Moore. Alongside me is Scott Majeski. And Scott, a lot of big storylines coming into today's game. PSAC West implications, homecoming for Slippery Rock, and a lot of wind going on up here. Yeah, everything's going to be a factor. The crowd, the weather, and it's a big game, Will. PSAC West right on the line. Winner this, most likely will be the champ in the PSAC championship game. More confusion on the sideline, but Andres will get work through it. Three wide receivers once again. Running back, lined up in a shotgun next to him. Andres is back. He'll walk up through the, and it's going to be picked off. California's going to come down with that. That's number 25 for the Vulcans. And how about that play? Sean Anderson for the Vulcans. Coming up huge. Well, they sent Andrews in. And really, California's attacks him, collapsed in the pocket. He's got to make a play. He looks right side. And then Sean Anderson just diving, making a fantastic interception, setting up the Vulcans offense with great field position at the 36, jumping that route and making a fantastic catch. The ball's on the 30-yard line. Once again, set up by the interception by Sean Anderson. And it'll be Lollick from the gun, Lamont Smith to his left. Lollick drops back, he'll fire and find his man. That's number one, Mario Washington. Washington. I think Austin, the ball's out. Austin. Looks like Slippery Rock jumped on him. Mario Washington just coming right over the middle of the field. Makes the catch, and I'm assuming he just got stripped. Let's take a look at this replay. It looks like coming right over the middle. Looks like number nine with the strip there for Slippery Rock, Will. And two straight turnovers of both defenses coming up big. Anthony Saunders on the strip, and number four, Zach Sheridan, General Sheridan with the recovery. Getting the Civil War references out of the way early here. Scott is on first down for the Rock. The crowd is energized here on homecoming. It's going to be a handoff up the middle, and now the ball's going to come out again. California, California falls on it. On it. This is just, th th there's no rain. There's The field's dry and everything. We did have a soccer game on this field beforehand, and right now we've had two straight fumbles, three turnovers in this game already. Two on the Slippery Rock side, and that man right there is Thomas Malava with a big pick, or excuse me, fumble recovery. What an exciting way to get this game going here. Turnover, 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 interception, fumble and fumble. The Vulcans get the ball back, and they're going to be looking for a touchdown here. Interesting that it should come on the ground through these fumbles here. Third and nine from the 16-yard line. And Endres will have to throw in a hurry. And this is going to be picked off in the back of the end zone. Rotez Miles coming down with it here. Winters is looking, he's looking, looking to find somebody open. He's got receivers to his left and to his right. The pressure just comes, so he has to get rid of it. So he throws it over the middle. And Rontez Miles does a smart thing with the pick and then downs it in the end zone to get his offense right there at the 20-yard line. Rontez Miles, a great heads-up play. He's been fired up this entire game. He knows how important this game is. Well, Endres is going to come back out with the offensive unit on fourth and one. A very aggressive play call in a game that has seen only three points in the first half. They're showing that they want this PSAC West title, and they'll go into the belly of the beast. Endres will fire. He's going to find his man, and he's going to get into the end zone. Touchdown! Slippery Rock University on the board. And that's Zubik with the reception up the left side. Got to like Coach Thompson's call there. I like it, the aggressiveness. If you're going to bring down the uh, coach, if you're going to bring down the king of the PSAC West over the previous six years, the best way to do it is the cannon was just shot off, took us a little bit by surprise. But if you're going to take the, oh, I'm still recovering from the cannon shot here a little bit. But you got to go into the belly of the beast, and that's what Slippery Rock did right there with the touchdown. And so with that, Slippery Rock leads 7 to 3 over the California Vulcans. And we still have another minute 16 to play here in the second quarter. So come on back for that and the conclusion of this game right here on CUTV. 
Second and five, ball on the 19-yard line. And it'll be Andres from the shotgun again. Andres is back, has a little bit of trouble holding onto this pass. He'll fire to the left side. It's complete, and he's in for the touchdown. Number five, James, the receiver, hauls it in, and now it is 16-3 as the cannon goes off once again at Mahalik Thompson Stadium. James is wide open here on the left side. Just an easy pass to throw to. Miles goes up for the big stick, but Rontes, you gotta come up with something a little bit better. Rapid tackle there. James, just too big, hangs on, makes the catch, walks in and a 16 to three advantage for the Rock of Slippery Rock. The kick is up and good. And the flag is waving over by the Rock for Slippery Rock. They lead here 17 to three over the California Vulcans. In the third quarter of action, we'll be back for more right here on CU TV, stay tuned. Andres is gonna fire to the end zone and this one's gonna be picked off, I believe. That's number 31, Eric Harris, and he's actually gonna get credit for this interception. And the Vulcans will take over. That'll be a touchback at the 20 yard line. All aboard the comeback train, Scott. Well, I'm looking on the field to see any yellow on the field and I don't <laughs> see any. So obviously this is now California ball. But I don't know yet, still 5.02 left, plenty of time, three timeouts for California. You gotta see if California can move the ball down the field. <laughs> but who knows? There you see a couple uh, Cal U, CU TV alumni enjoying the game today. Stephanie Smith Rubel, and alongside her, Mr. Andrew Walter, former play by play man of the California Vulcans here on CU TV Sports. That's nice to get down on the field and mingle with the rabble every now and then, but that play will do it. And the California Vulcans have fallen to the Slippery Rock Rock here. Slippery Rock improves to six and one, three and or four and oh in the PSAC West. California will fall to five and two overall, three and one in the PSAC West. And we will have next week's game, homecoming at California, when the Mercyhurst Lakers come to town. That'll do it for our, P our crew here with CU TV Sports. My name's Will Moore for Scott Majeski. Thanks for watching, everyone. We'll see you next week back at Adamson.